So everybody hit the like button, man. Well, yeah, I would not let him go in there if we can. I don't know. So I'm doing an interview, sir. Are you doing an interview? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, move. <laughs> Who else does this, man? Who else do shit like this, man? What mayor is this? What city's mayor is this, man? What city's mayor is this, man? <laughs> Who else do stuff like this, man? Who else out of pocket like this, man? And they calling the mayor a beta. Now the mayor and a beta. He just know if he if he touch that black dude, that black dude. He, listen. This black dude got privilege in this situation, man. If anybody touch him, they wrong, man. <laughs> and there's a parameter. There's only a few statements you can make to him without being racist. But he get to do anything he want. Yeah, bro, this is the question. I would not let him go in there if we can. I don't know. You want to say something stupid? Drop the word, just slap him in the face. Sir, I'm doing an interview, sir. Are you doing an interview? Yeah. Sir, I'm doing an interview, sir. Ryan Clark trying to make it seem like people, that white people just be like, hey, N word. Like white people just see black people just like, get out of my way. <laughs> He knows nothing's further than the truth. White people, um, white people give black people three feet. White people give black people a lot of leeway, man. To to be their natural out of pocket selves, man. Oh yeah, I'm moving on. I work right there. I was just I'm talking on the phone. You got a problem? Yeah, we're just trying to do it. Okay, cool. cool. I appreciate you, Mike. Yeah, you Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go do what I'm gonna do right before you walk up. You know, either way it goes. First off, hold up. What? No, no, no. Nah, bro, hold up. Hold up. No, no. Let go. Hold on a second. No, no. I'll smack you right now, bitch. I will smack you. You want to get smacked? Look at the white woman, the most protected person on the planet. Now that she's now, now that she's here, this black man will instantly know his place, man, because the blonde haired white woman showed up, man. And now he knows that he can't act like a fool because the white woman is here. And if he acts like a fool in front of the white woman, he'll be lynched by midnight. <laughs> Come on, security, man. Come on, security, man. You can't let some random brother just walk up and start whooping you in front of the mayor, man. Your job, man. The mayor, the mayor looking at you, man. The mayor, mayor, you might want to get some better security than this, man. Mayor, so and so, you might want to get some better security than this. <laughs> Yeah, man, he's not securing the situation, man. <laughs> he getting hit up. <laughs> he getting hit upside the head. Look at that white woman taking his stick, taking the black man's metal pole, man. Look at that evil white woman. That's just how white women do. As soon as a black man turns his back, as soon as a black man turns his back, 
a white woman comes in and as an age, she's she's the she's the backbone of white supremacy. <laughs> she's the backbone of white supremacy. Yo, why you letting them get near the mayor, man? Security, man. You got to get between him and the mayor, man, and a white woman. Because that white woman is the um is the most protected woman on the planet, man. You're not protecting her, man. Like the most protected woman on the planet, man. Back up. This security guard looked like he he bounced at white gloves. <laughs> this security guard bounce. You can tell you he 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 bounces at white clubs, man. He don't bounce at the at the hip hop club. <laughs> He'd have been ready for this shit, man. <laughs> hit the PayPal, hit the cash app, hit the super chat. We need more supporters than two, man. We need more than two supporters, man. More than three supporters, man. More than four supporters. More than five supporters, man. An hour into the show, man. Salute to Eric S. Op Nation Hall of Famer. Coming through once again. It's the Aster J, man. Op Nation Hall of Famer. He says... Ah, when I hear these sons say this dumb shit, there's no way they built the pyramids or anything of the massive structures. Yeah, man. You can't build no pyramids with these thinking this stupidly. Yeah, I'm pro bono, man. Yeah, I'm giving it to you pro bono, man. I'm a pro bono. But you know what, though? You know what, though? Even though we don't have the zealous support of other channels, ain't nobody doing it like this. It don't matter. They still ain't doing it like this. That goes to show you that even though other people may have more zealous supporters, it don't matter. Ain't nobody doing it like this, man. They can't, man. They can't. They can't, man. They can't. Little Yachty may sell more records than Nas. But do that mean he a better rapper than Nas? Huh? Does that mean he a better rapper than us? Kid and play may sell more records than the Wu Tang Clan. But that, do that mean they better rappers than the Wu Tang Clan? Salute to Boy Katina, man. Boy Katina in the building, man. This security guard, though, man, he he definitely bounces at white clubs. He was not ready for this, man. Uh, yeah. That brother footwork. <laughs> hey man, that brother got some mean footwork, man. I ain't even gonna lie though, man. That brother got some good footwork. The brother is taking it easy on him because look, I see a couple of straight jabs that could listen. 
Watch this. This guy's open for a straight jab right there. Boom. He open for another jab. He open for a combo right here. Bing, bing. <laughs> The brother taking it easy on him now, man. Brother just doing them like Muhammad Ali, man. Brother playing with him like Muhammad Ali, man. How much I want bet if Ryan Clark walked up right now? Let's just say at this at this moment, Ryan Clark walks up. What would Ryan Clark do if he walked up at this moment? <laughs> Shout out to Boy Kachita. What would Ryan Clark do if he walked up at this moment? Man? This crazy, man. <laughs> Ryan Clark will walk up and be like, see, look, man. They always messing with a black man for no reason, man. He pull out his phone and shit and be like, this is a travesty, man. This brother ain't even doing nothing. He did. And a bald head of white supremacy is trying to take him down, man. <laughs> I should clip this, I should clip this part right here and put it on live. <laughs> it's it, 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 it watch black people go crazy and shit and laugh at him. Look at all these white people standing around as this. <laughs> Somebody clip this part. All these white people standing around as this black man, this unhoused black man, is being assaulted by this white. Supremacist. So security card probably knows Crab Maga or Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, but he know that it's going to look bad, man, beating up a black dude, man. So he got to try to take him down in a without striking him. He got to try to take the black dude down without striking him. Why do so many police officers show up? Why there so many police officers have to show up? <laughs> Dang, man. All these police just for one dude? <laughs> I love when they say that. I love when black people say stupid stuff like that. Dang, man. All these police is for just one dude? Dang, man. Look at, look at Karen here, man. She out here calling, the, look at her on the phone, always on the damn phone, calling the law on a black man. See right here, I'm gonna clip that part. That's the part I'm gonna clip with a black dude saying, "Let me go." <laughs> That's the part. Clip that part. 
Just that little part. Let me go, man. Let me go. Put it online, man. Watch the black people go crazy. See, this is what we got to deal with in this racist America. KKK. You see how I did that? I took the C and I made the three Ks. This is what we got to deal with in America. KKK. Think about this. Not one person helped this guy. Boom. Not one person helped this white dude detain this black guy. There's dozens of people have walked past. There's all these people out in front of the, that, that's with the mayor's team. Not one person gave a shred of assistance in detaining this guy. Not one. He wouldn't have did that, you no know, son, man, man. He did that because he, he smelled Badussy. He knew he seen these white people, he smelled Badussy. He wouldn't have did that with no son people. If white supremacy is so bad, you would think that white people would just see this and be like, oh, oh God, an unruly Negro. Let me help you. Hey, guys, uh, the, the, this, 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 this agent of white supremacy is having a tough time with an unruly Negro. Let's all band together and uh, help subdue him. Not one person helped him. There's no such thing as white supremacy. Press one. Salute the product of Cook County, man. You say, can't help but support for the nation. Because where else can you find someone keeping it so real in a chat so dedicated? R.I.P. DVK. Salute, man. Hey, man, they try to make it seem like, oh, every, every second of the day, white people are just, my God. And no matter what you do, white people are just there. I mean, my God. Nah, man, y'all got it good, man. Ain't nobody doing nothing to y'all. White people scared to intervene, man. And listen, I don't even remember a time when they would have intervened. Finally, white supremacists show up. With, look how long it took white supremacy to show up, man. White supremacy was on color people time, man. You know it's fucked up when white supremacy is on color people time. Oh, now you want to step up, Mr. Mayor, like you was in it. We got you on camera, standing there watching your security tussle with this son man for three minutes. The life of a California mayor, man. The life of a California mayor. Yeah. This guy says there are five or, or six men right there, and instead of just putting an end to it, they all all their phones go fell. <laughs> yeah, man, all the men just stand there calling for help. <laughs> all this dude tussling with this son, man, man, and and some men got strong. We strong, man. We got dense bones, man.
So this is the mayor, man. Matthew. Matthew. Mahan. Born in 1982, he's an American politician and tech entrepreneur. Serving his first term as mayor of San Jose. Mm. Mayor of San Jose, you know he woke. You know he's woke. The mayor of San Jose. Mahan was raised in Watonsville, California. He attended Bella Mean, Bellarmine College Preparatory, where his uncle, California real estate developer Ed Thrift, had previously attended on a low-income scholarship. While in high school, Mahan worked with former state senator Jim Beal and former Santa Clara Council Anna Ravel. Mahan graduated from Harvard University in 2005. In college, Mahan served as president of the Harvard Undergraduate Council. Damn, this is an upper crust son, um, glider, man. This is a super glider, man. He went to Harvard, went to Bellarmine College Preparatory School, man. This glider, man, shot, and, and all he got was the mayor of San Jose, man. <laughs> Yeah, you're supposed to be like a, a senator or something, man. How old is he? 82. Yeah, he's young. He, he Maybe he'll be a senator one day. He was president of the undergraduate council at Harvard when he was a student. He spent a year building irrigation systems in Bolivia. Okay, so he, he like Mr. Beast, man. He be going to the third world, helping people out and shit. In 2008, Mahan joined forces, joined a tech startup led by Sean Parker and Joe Green. Together, they formed Causes, an early Facebook application focused on grassroots and public engagement that helped raise money for nonprofit organizations. Mahan became CEO and president of Causes in 2013. Uh-oh. Uh oh, he won't. Uh oh. Yeah. He's a Democrat, man. 